Hello, three. Hello, three. Kashana, na, 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 na. Kashama, ma, ma, na, na. You saw us on YouTube, you saw a very good version because I got very reason to take this evil and good version of this and other things. You give her a Patreon or channel membership, so I'll link the description below. Please go check that out. And this part, we'll talk about the movie and review it. Okay? 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 Let's finish this movie, huh? That freaked me out, man. Me too. It looked like a real guy. Why not just shoot him? Right. I mean, I guess if he falls off, the bag falls with him. That's true. I guess. Hey, nice. That's my train. Oh, ow. That's dangerous. Oh, good lord. They fell a while. They sure did. <laughs> nice shot. Wow. I should call the authorities. <laughs> That's right. Hug him to death. <laughs> Take the money. You just ran past the money bag. Oh, my goodness. He wants the money. Oh. You should have thought of that when you ran past it the first time, bucko. Hey. Yeah, I set that onto a different track. Here we go. Off the edge. Into a town? No! What a how shot. Is, how is that safer than the other track? <laughs> wow, what a shot. Once again, we got one shot, one try at this. One shot at this, yeah. I'm just confused as how is de right. <laughs> derailing it into a town safer than letting it keep going on the track? Exactly. But I think they're going to be... <laughs> They're gonna be in trouble with the authorities. I believe there were probably 19 or 20 children murdered in that sequence. There are too many of them. What are we going to do? I'm never riding with that train company again. <laughs> They're gone. It is like romancing the stone. We're gonna get away with the money. Spoiler alert. Where are my children? <laughs> yeah, let's go. We don't need to help these innocent yeah. bystanders looking for their buried children. Bank robbery someone in Chintabu. Montonga, choose court. Bale Valle, you don't have the man chasing the Mirka, the Nairgard and Magdals. I know strong a Miru Purgate, the Mamani Purgate. You knew this whole time? Now you're telling us now? Kuncham, no, I did everything patient. Or do another musical number. I'm so thankful to you. See you. Bye. But what, 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 why are you so weird all of a sudden, bro? You just bro? fall out of a coconut Janna? tree? I drop I think Mama could have learned to chase under. She's like, I drive stick. Mama could have been purchased. Oh, that's a very cute. Yeah, wow. No, wow. what a film! I very much enjoyed that. I did too. That was a, that was a very nice film. I give, give it a gold. Oh, gold! I give this one some gold. Um. Kashana Kashama. I really, really like this movie from start to finish. What does it mean? Kashana Kashama. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I was, I mean, I think almost every film we've seen of, of his, 
we've been impressed by his directing, but this one was very, especially his shot choices and his, uh, I guess his um, Gopal Reddy. Yeah, Gopal Reddy S. Wonderful cinematography. Um, so him, obviously, we've said it many times, director, DP, one of the most contentious slash close relationships on an entire film set. Yeah. Very important. Hence why most directors almost always work with the same DP yeah. for a lot of their career. Yeah. Because it's one that you kind of have to trust each other. Yep. Um, but so regardless of who it was, it was very impressive, the uh, the directing style and yeah. the shot choices from the, in this. From the beginning of the movie, that whole robbery sequence at the mm -hmm. very outset. Yeah. Yeah. Um, very, very impressive. Hats off to both of them. And yeah, obviously Ram Gopavarma with his writing um, did a very good job. It was a very intriguing story. Mm -hmm. It kept you engaged the, the whole, whole time. time. For a 1991 film, which obviously has some dated stuff in it, Yeah, it was very engaging. Very engaging. And uh, they had great chemistry. Yeah, uh, I've, The comedy worked. Especially I loved, with our, our antagonist. Yeah, our antagonist was just wonderful. He, he did... Uh, and when we've seen him in it, a, quite a other different things, Parash Rawal. Yeah, we've seen him in a lot of oh, things. Oh, that's yeah, weird. yeah, yeah. Kay. We've seen him in a lot. I of things. I just know him older, right? Like in OMG and stuff. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've seen him on a lot of things. Yes, I just know him older, but, but I recognize his face. Not just his comic timing, but boy, did he understand the power of stillness, especially for an antagonist. Yeah, he was both menacing and hysterically funny. Um, just hats off to the writing there too. Obviously. Yeah, great writing, and it it just the story. It reminded me a lot. If you've never seen Romancing the Stone, it reminded me a lot of Romancing the Stone. I need a rewatch. I haven't seen it in such a long time. Yeah, that's just a fun. That's more. That's a little more. No, they're about the same. It's it's kind of a a, a caper rom com. Uh, Danny DeVito's also in it. Yeah. Um, and great chemistry with Kathleen Turner and Michael Douglas. And it was really interesting because the um, the first half was full on. I think for the first hour twenty minutes was full on kind of just a kind of old school eighties nineties kind of thriller. There were right no songs. like like gangster and then drama. There were like six songs in the second half, and it, it became um, partially sure, but also the romance. They were that's really, where it, that's why it worked. Yeah, because it's highlighting how they're feeling about each other. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but it, it was. Definitely a different vibe, uh, but it went really well. The uh, com composition was M.M. Yeah, Kiravani, wonderful score. Did a great job with the score and the songs. Yeah, that's that's R.R. That's oh! the Oscar-winning director. Oh! That's Oscar. Well, no Oscar. wonder the score is so good. I, like, I recognize that name. That's the R.R. <laughs> Oscar-winning composer. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, he did a great job there. Um, great choice, stupid babies. Uh, thank you for, obviously, yeah. uh, waiting uh for us there but yeah i i, I enjoyed the film that was um i watched that's why it's gold for me because the difference between silver and gold for me is silver i really enjoyed it but i wouldn't necessarily watch it again mm -hmm. i'd watch this again without yeah. hesitation i'd watch this again yeah, it's a lot of really fun obviously <laughs> there's dated things in it but you it, it goes back to when we watched classic month too i mean 1991 so you're 33 years old right so it's definitely a classic you right. know obviously for the telugu industry so it it it's almost endearing. Exactly. And especially how difficult a lot of this stuff in here was. Some of the cinematography it it must have been nominated if not won some I cinematography awards because for the day we take it for granted some of those shots were really really difficult. Yeah, and I I'm trying to remember in all of his other stuff that we've seen, obviously his older stuff. So this was his uh, oh wow! Really one, early. One, two. No, that was associate director. So he did uh, something called Nuclear, which was his directorial debut, and then Shiva, and then she, a remake, I guess, maybe in a different language, right? Probably. So, so this is like his third film. Third. Film. Wow! You can already see the greatness. Okay, but look, you got Rot, Rot which, immediately uh, after that, and then you got that we've seen Rangila, and then. Satya, Satya and Kaun, Kaun and Ooh, then there's, back to back. Uh, I know Company's bit a boot. A boot. Uh, Company is a big one that we need to see. Uh, that a lot of people say probably might be his best. So, uh, Jay uh, Dev guns in that one. I'm looking I'm looking and forward to it. This one as well. I've heard a lot. I think this is like almost a Godfathery style. It's yeah, like I remember Big with Big B. I've I seen KK Menon is also in it. Yeah. Um, and then he gets kind of. I know people really say he kind of fell off late. 
2000. As far as quality? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why. I don't know what happened, but <laughs> I know that's a, a thing that people have said before to me. But in terms of those other ones, so Boot, um, Gaon, Satya, uh, Satya is probably... Artistically. The best. That one's the most elevative. But in terms of like the shot, I don't remember, even though I'm like, yeah, these are nice. I don't remember saying that many times in those, how many times I said in this one, how brilliant the cinematography that shot choice. Yeah, were. the cinematography is a real standout in this film. Um, this is one of those movies where if I'm recommending it to people, I'm going to say, first of all, you're going to see again why Sri Devi was Sri oh, Devi. Good Lord. You're going to see great chemistry from them. You're going to get a great bad guy, a, a story that keeps you engaged. But one of the big standouts are score. Yes. And that cinematography, just pay attention to the time and what they did and some of the shots that I don't know if it was him or his DP making the choice. So they're coming across the bridge. How are we going to get the shot with them just coming? No, you're going to start over here. You're going to yeah. go all the way up and around and catch them. Or we're going to start down in the water and then we're going to come up over the bridge and pull back lens as you're crossing or we'll be behind them. You're going to be in the water, but frame is going to be above the water. And as you pull back, we'll see you're in the water, but don't leave a wake as you're walking backward in the water. Yeah. Carrying be, a 35 millimeter camera. It'd be really interesting to, uh, if we ever get to talk to him one day, um, to oh. talk about like his shot choices yeah. in this and how it looks like how difficult it must have been. How, I don't know how much those cameras back in the day, I'm assuming this was filmed uh, on film. Yeah. Being 1991 in the Tadalugu yeah. industry. So I'm assuming it was shot on film. Yeah, of course. And those cameras are heavy. They're very heavy. Also, we noted this at the outset with that bank robbery scene, how he understands the, wireless. The, 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 the storytelling capacity of what you show and what you don't show. Yeah. The other thing that's very evident, it would not surprise me if at this point and through his career, he was a real student of all kinds of cinema because that train sequence... Oh. There were some shots that were just like some of your standard classic Western train sequences. And they're so difficult to shoot. And some of that stunt work, the dude under the train. Yeah. Wow. Shout out to whoever the stunt coordinator wow. was and the stunt people. Yeah. Hats For the off, day. Because there was a lot of good stunt work, but especially the end where the, you yeah, saw the, people fall the train off sequence. trains into another uh, area. Or under, I must, it had to have been. It had to have been a dummy. Yeah. But it looked like a real person. It, it was if shocking. It, was a real, it scared me. If it was a real person, I'd be like, oh, my God. I don't know that I'd feel comfortable. Yeah. No, that scared me. <laughs> Doing that. It was very shocking. Um, I mean, I know the train definitely wasn't going full speed, but it doesn't matter. Train can be going one mile an hour. Right. It'll cut you in half. Right, of course. <laughs> absolute insanity. Um, yeah. Street Evie was... Absolutely gorgeous. She's, man. she's she just wonderful. The goddess of Indian cinema. Uh, her character got really annoying. Just <laughs> how much of a damsel in distress she was. I know, it's so bad. Uh, just like some of the dumb things. There's no bullets in there. What are you saying that for? Um, and then just screaming. Again, that's, like it, that's very romancing the stone. Oh yeah, I Kathleen mean, Turner does that to Michael Douglas a lot. It, there, it, there's real people that do that all the time. Like the, you see these things, events that happen. Like there's a fight or something, and a woman is just like. <gasps> Oh, oh yeah. damn it! It's like, like how, how do you think stop. that helps? It's anything? not helping anybody. I get it. You're tensed, my, but my, shut up. My favorite in all films is when someone's hanging on to something and they're going to fall, and the other person screams, "Don't let go!" <laughs> oh, oh, what's going to? My God, thank you for reminding me. I was, what would I have done without you telling me that? <laughs> uh, he, he did also a very good job. He had a very suave yeah. look to him. He was wonderful. Uh, Ven uh, Venkatesh Dagobati. Have we seen him before? He looks familiar to me. Oh, he, Guru. He was, no, that, I don't know if that's the Hindi Guru. Okay. Um, no, it's not. I mean, it wasn't just the reminder that he he had the same kind Chirvan. of vibe. Yeah. I, I imagine... Chiravanji is such a massive star in the Telugu industry. Everybody was trying to look like of course. Kieran GV. Okay, but um, I feel like we have seen him in at least one other thing. Jushim 2, technically we saw him in, but I don't remember much about that movie. Was he a cop? Might have been. I think he was a cop in Jushim 2, um, and that's where I remember him from. Let's see. Going down his uh, filmography here. We're in 2005. 
He because he looks familiar. Might just look like because he looks like Chirin G. I think and, it's. I think we it's saw at too. least three songs from this true uh, thing. So That's true. We have seen him before, but he he was great. He did a very good job. Very good job. Um, I want to recreate his uh, Jean look. That was, a, <laughs> that was an iconic look right there. Um, that was it, right? 1991. Yeah. So uh, I don't know when well, I'm we thankful. Would, would have seen him. And thank you, because um, normally I'm I'm uh, hesitant a lot of times to do watch alongs for older films just because, like, really older films, like, this is 33 right. years old because you never know it's, there's stuff that's dated is it going to be engaging for you guys to watch us we'll watch them but I, to do watch alongs i'm always like i don't know if older films will, right will work now this was a good call it's a good one because I, I feel like that one artistically there's a lot there yep. and there was enough action that was very quality action especially for a 33 year old film yep um how would you rank uh the uh the old rambo above armor films oh my stars so though i if i'm if i'm not missing them we have boot great film um, and this directing is what I'm talking about. Kaun, Satya, uh, Rangila, uh, Rat, and then this one. That's, I, so I, I don't know. I know Rat will be your last. Yeah, it would be at the bottom. I like that one more than you like yeah. that one. But, but you said the first three, Bhut, mm -hmm. Satya, and Kaun. Kaun, and then this I one. And this one. All four of those Rangila, I love for different reasons. Amir Khan. Right, and Rangila. I, for, 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 for four different I love them all for various different reasons. I don't know that I could pick one above the other, other than Satya's got it's artistic, but that this one artistic. Might, I mean, this one might be right under that one. Yeah, it's really good. Um, in terms of very this, difficult, even though this had a lot more of a commercial feel than Satya ever. Yes, did. right. Um, because the only issue I believe from what I had with Satya was that the wonderful song that Vishal Bardwash um, composed in it. Just felt you didn't, out, of out of place, right? Because it felt like such a that. serious movie, right? Whereas this one, you had a much more commercial feel, even though you had a lot of serious moments as well. Um, which goes to his versatility. Yeah, Name all those films, how different they're all so of them different. Are. He does like the crime genre, that is for sure. Uh, but and scary, yeah. But they're all very. He might. I mean, Boot is definitely one of the best horrors we've yes. ever seen from India. Yeah. Um, so hats off to him. I would love to see. Yeah, it, and uh, I, I keep work. referring it all the time, but I really one of my favorite '80s rom coms is *Romancing the Stone*, and I like this film as much as I like *Romancing the Stone*. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's just a lot of fun. A long time since a lot of fun. One. Uh, I was probably like 11, I bet, when I watched that. It's a fun. It's very. It's dated. It's It'll be definitely dated, but it's a fun movie. Yeah. Anyway, uh, speaking of dated, and uh, have you ever seen *Alien 3*? I think I did see Alien. I know I saw one and two. Yes. I think I did see Alien oh, 3. Oh, it's terrible. Yeah, it's awful. I remember not it's liking it. definitely the worst of the franchise. Yeah, I, I remember not liking it. Um, Alien 2 was... Well, I enjoyed it. Oh, great. It. Yeah, Alien 1 it and 2 are great. It was a good sequel. Best of the series yeah. are, are Alien 1 and 2. And so I was, I've been going through the thing because whenever Alien Romulus... Romulus. Comes, I will I'm watch interested. it, I will watch it on OTT. OTT. Right. Me and too. now I just have Alien Resurrection left. Did not see that. Um... The the uh, Alien Three, ev it felt even though it was newer than one and two, it felt more dated, uh, and felt eighties and so hokey. Uh, it was yeah, it didn't fit the series at all. Not at all. I'd rather watch Alien versus Predator and how campy and silly that film is yep. over uh, whatever Alien. Yeah, I agree. And I've heard good things about Alien Romulus. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Uh, let us know uh, what you thought about this movie. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, which we are next Telugu watch along. And even though I know he does not do just Telugu, we've seen many Hindi and I think Tamil uh, from him as well. Now this is Telugu, which we are next uh, Ram Gopal Varma film. I know uh, that Big B one and um, Company yeah. are two big ones that I know a lot of people. And say then obviously the list for Sri Devi's enormous, en endless. Yeah. Uh, let us know what all that should be. Uh, if you like this and you saw it on YouTube, you could see you'll see a very cut of version because of copyright reasons. If you see full and cut version of this and other watch alongs, Telugu watch alongs, we do have them. Uh, you can have to Patreon or channel memberships. I'll put a link in the description below. Thank right over there. Check that out and uh, let us know what our next Telugu watch along should be down below. On to the next watch along.